Well, hello there. It's Kate Phoenix. I am going to play a Dragon Mage, but first I need to figure out what the heck I was doing last time. And I need to turn the volume. Okay, let's see if that's any better. Uh, that sounds better. Okay, cool. So, we are... Okay, let's take that, because we we'll just take every single quest there is. <clears throat> Alright, we're at the Chantry. We finished all the Chanter's Board stuff. What are we doing? Are we gonna go back to Bristling the Forest and find that place? I don't know. Let's Alright. Anything I can get you? Good luck to you then. I should go. <laughs> if it isn't the hero of the day, what can I get you? Right, I've got some supplies too, in case you're interested. With the store closed down, it doesn't hurt to pick up some of the slack, eh? Some lesser stuff. Let's sell. <coughs> Let's sell all our lesser stuff. Whoops. Sell. I've never actually used an intrigue. <laughs> I don't think I've ever used any of these potions. Maybe. brother and his family made it out of Lothering. He said that the Darkspawn Those... attacked it the very next day. The Darkspawn took Lothering, did they? I don't know. I expect so, since there was no one there to stop them. Well, it won't be much longer until those monsters get here. There doesn't seem to be anyone fighting them now. Hey, hey, Best be hey. careful. Darkspawn are coming. Dude. Greetings, my lady. So, what does your uncle say? Is he doing what you said? Not so loud. Not so loud. Look later. Not while you're yelling about, that's for sure. Okay. Let's. Um, let's get out of here. Let's go back to the Brazilian forest. Kind of interested to take Zevran there. I feel like the party banter isn't as good with this combo.
Like, not like the other three are constantly talking to each other, but at least they talk a little bit. World map. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Shing. <laughs> yep, figured. It's gonna be dark spawn. Oh, it's not. That through generator. Bloody What's corpse. On your mind? Nah, I don't. I oh. try not to dwell okay. too much on the mistakes of my past, of which there are many. I would go quite mad if I did that. But I do have one regret. The greatest misstep of my life. Made even more grave because it had dire consequences for someone else. Years ago, I was assigned as mentor to a lad, Anaren. He was my first apprentice. Anaren was an elf, raised in one of the elven alienages. And he was very mistrustful of humans, especially humans in authority. I mean, for good reason. What Anaren needed was time. Time to get used to his new home. Time to emerge from his shell so we could build a rapport. I gave him no such time. I was young and arrogant. He is a mage, I thought. He needs to grow up and act like one. I expected too much from him, too quickly. I gave no consideration to his origin or his feelings. And he retreated further from me. All I could oh, good think job, of was how stubborn he was, how he was throwing away all his talent and his potential, just to be difficult. Just be a bitch. Oh, I dread to think. I was a harsh taskmistress. He might have thought I was a demon in disguise. You cannot plant crops in the cold, wintry ground. You cannot teach a student who is closed off and unresponsive. Patience is what is needed, and I learned that too late to help him. Anaren oh ran away from the circle one night. I had berated him over some trivial, ridiculous matter that I no longer remember. I drove him away because of something utterly unimportant. He was a child, 14 at the time of his leaving. They had his phylactery, and they hunted him down. The Templars. That is what they do. They hunt down and neutralize rogue mages. They called him Maleficar, a mage who practices forbidden magic, deserving of death. He was a child, misunderstood and lost. I begged the Templars to tell me if he suffered, if they gave him a quick death. I got no answers from them. I was his mentor, and they wouldn't even tell me what became of him. I should have known better. I had the best mentors. They were kind, compassionate. Why didn't I learn from them? I failed in Aaron. All I had to do was listen to him. He would try to talk to me, and I would tell him to concentrate on his spells. <sighs> I talked about the alienage sometime. And the Dalish. He always talked about looking for the Dalish elves. The Templars are well trained and thorough. That he still lives, it would be a vain hope. The apprentices that came after Anaren benefited greatly from the lessons I learned from him. In a sense, he was my teacher, and I his student. And there it is. My story, my one greatest regret. New quest. Oh, I'm so surprised. Why are there bloody corpses here? What's this do? Uh. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, Jesus, Stan. Fuck. Oh, hold on. I have rejuvenation, don't I? 
group heal, life ward, revival, that's what I meant. Alright, nurse. Good stun, Jesus Christ. I got the green guy. <laughs> Dumb. <laughs> Mana steal. Oh, let's let's uh let's drop a nice group heal here. Oh, we're done. Okay. You know, I knew that that was gonna go bad somehow. Vegas war boots. Uh, oh. Uh, yes, please. Mm, put those right on. Yeah, I knew that was going to go bad, but I still did not <laughs> expect that. Oh, feed striders, yeah. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these guys on. And then maybe I'll give the. What did I just do? I don't know what the heck I just did. Oh, I moved something to junk. No, I can't do it. Okay. I pressed the button, but it didn't happen. Okay. Um, no, this one. There we go. I don't play for five days, and all of a sudden I forget how to play at all. Oh, see those? Yeah. Alright, I was just going to keep them. Okay. Coolio. All right. Okay, let's see Aren't if Anaren is here. Chilly. I don't know this word. It's much warmer where you're from, isn't it? Don't you feel cold? I suppose. I don't imagine we can find a cloak in your size, can we? What? It's not that much bigger. Nothing, nothing. Don't mind me. Now I wonder where I could get a skein of good wool yarn. I understand we will be joining you in battle as soon as the hunters have recovered. I look forward to it. Good. I understand that I don't have any intention intonation in my voice. <laughs> Hunter. Landmark tent. Uh. And there an Atitian Grey Warden. Join us at the fire if you like, but haven't you got a war to get to? I I appreciate you trying to find him, but what are the chances? Anaren the healer? You know Anaren? He he lives. No, <laughs> it can't be him. Perhaps it is a common oh. elven name. No, I know of only one in Aaron. Ah, it makes sense. And Aaron said that he was from the human cities. You are old friends then. Well. <laughs> if you seek an Aaron, you must venture into the forest. He prefers to be amidst the trees and the animals. Thank you all so much. We know only what Zathrian has told us over the years. I never saw one myself until... Of course. Alright, well, I already solved that, so... Darth I don't know why we're talking about that. Okay. Uh, ba -ba -ba -bum. Hmm. Perhaps I could have a try at that. It cannot be done. Severin, you're so useless. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, the holla, holla lady. I forget what I'm supposed to do for that. Uh, do, 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 blood curse. Examine the beast. Greater survival skill. Do we have anyone with good survival skill? Hmm. 
I have none. Oh. Sten? Can he do that? Is it like the whole party? Come to check on my Hala and I then have... I don't know. Do you have any skills that might... No. No, I'm sorry. She isn't calming any more around you than she is for me. I know. It was kind of you to try. I will watch her for a while. Alright, I need to... Hmm. Let's go back. Let's get a different party. This way. <laughs> Run around in circles with Kate. Alright, we're gonna get a different party. We're gonna see if we have survival people. And then we're gonna come back and see if we can holla. Holla! Then why do you suck so much? You've got, like, well, I mean, it's not stupendous armor, but let's see, compared that to better than Zev, not nearly as good as, uh, oh, but he's got pluses because he has the full Warden Commander thing. Hmm. Alright. Oh, should Nicole. I talk to people while I'm here? I am hardly surprised. Very well. Alright, that's fine. Speak then. Then I suggest we move eh. on. As you You really don't like to talk I was much just to you. About what happened to the elves, and I am reminded of a song sung to me many years ago. It was when my mother died, and this wise elven woman comforted me and told me that we shouldn't fear death or hate it. Death is just another beginning. One day, is that like a six pack molded into survive. armor? It's a beautiful <laughs> sentiment, I think, one that brings peace and hope to the grieving. Oh, she's going to sing a song. Her singing voice sounds completely different from her talking voice. likes it. She's so much taller than me. Sten's like, what the fuck is going on over there? He laughs at booty? What kind of song is this? Booty. 
He laughs at booty. <laughs> oh, okay. That that's just that's it. We're just gonna Okay. I guess we're done. What's on your mind? When I just talked to Oh, I was thinking Is about being a Grey you? Warden. No one said it would be easy. You are one of the two surviving Grey Wardens in Ferelden. You defend all of us, and much rests on your shoulders. It may not mean much to you, but thank you for having the courage to continue to fight. Mm -mm. And that gives me. I hope. didn't have a choice, but that's okay. Have you heard right. much about the Grey Wardens of old? It was said that watching the wardens ride in on their white griffins was enough to rouse a weary heart and put the dance back in the step of an old man. The Grey Wardens were powerful, feared and respected, but they also inspired the common people. I remember a tale that was told to me many years ago. Oh, you're not going to tell it now, are you? <laughs> the land for months, oh. and the armies you know, of the I can't be mean in these games, but stand as the sun that would be really light, funny. Boiled and churned in the dark sky above, it illuminated a vast, seething horde of darkspawn with the archdemon at its head. And it was then when courage seemed to fail and all lost to death and despair that the Grey Wardens came. They arrived with the beating of wings like mighty war drums and stood before the armies of men. Okay. Griffins? Griffins. Now listen to the rest of the story. <laughs> the Grey Wardens, grim and fearless, marched forth, ever between the men and the encroaching darkspawn. They formed a shield of their own Griffins? bodies. Yes, Griffins. Now listen to the rest the of the story. Was dead, and uh. the last dark spawn lay trampled in the dirt. Oh my and god. Dead, demanding neither reward nor recognition for their sacrifice. The Grey Wardens departed. When the clouds finally rolled back, and the sun shone full upon the blighted ground, the Grey Kings knew that they had lost no men, and none of their blood had been spilled. This is a tale about no battle the Grey Wardens have fought. And yet, about them all, they have always defended us from the Darkspawn, taking losses so we do not have Hell when People may have forgotten over the centuries, but nothing has changed. This knowledge has been blessing and burden to Grey Wardens past. And now, it shall be your blessing and your burden. Okie dokie. Oh. The Circle of Magi stands ready to assist, Grey Warden, as do oh, the you're so creepy. of the Chantry. There are always areas. You witness the rarest of things, Warden. The Dalish stand ready to defend Ferelden. We have assembled on a short schedule. Certain factors of equipment could be better, crafting components would serve best. Basic ones like elf root and deep mushroom. Oh, how is deep mushroom a crafting component? Uh, I don't know for weapons and armor. I On your know. order, Grey Warden. Uh, the all was generous, but rushed. Certain areas could see improvement. We're a mercenary force, Warden. Much of our equipment is self-financed. Were you to commit additional funds? You want money from me? Upgrade as we saw the need. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, let's see. Turning crafting mats, turning coins. Alright, look. Uh, all elf roots. Well, you know what? I don't have any use for them, but I don't know if I need them. Turning coins. I'll do ten. Ching! 
The men are ready to follow you anywhere, thanks to your confident investment. Okay. They should have been ready to follow me anywhere anyway, but, you know. Al, do you have anything to say? Of course. Mm, nope. Your desire is my command. Well, we're in camp. Now's as good a time as any to talk, right? Fair enough. Why, well, you know, have some what is your thing desire? to say. Hmm, I could teach others, but not yourself. First, I would need someone who has... But, if there should be such a person who desires this training... Ooh. What is your desire? Alright, uh, but I get to stare at you luridly while you do so. <laughs> and why not? There are many things to enjoy about being a crow in Antiva. You are respected, you are feared, the authorities go out of their way to overlook your trespasses, even the rewards are nothing to turn your nose up at. As for the killing part, well, some people simply need assassinating. Or do you disagree? Um. Now there is an interesting mm. word, innocent. How many men do you know who can claim to be truly innocent? But, if you're talking generalities, such as children and relatives and bystanders and such, never on purpose, but it happens. It's unfortunate, but death comes to us all. If not me, then some wasting disease, or a fall down the stairs, or at the hands of a darkspawn. It's all relative in the end. Death happens, as we like to say. And when I get paid for it, death happens more often. As far as enjoying <laughs> the act of killing itself, why not? There is a certain artistry to the deed. The pleasure of sinking your blade into their flesh and knowing that their life is in your hands. It is not pleasure, per se. Nothing sexual. It is more a sense of satisfaction, a feeling of power. Does that make sense? No matter. There are many things I did not enjoy about being a crow, of course. Having no choice, being treated as an expendable commodity, the rules, oh, so many rules. But simply being an assassin, I like it just fine. I will continue to do it if I can, even if I am not a crow. Honestly, could you picture me doing something else? <laughs> <laughs> I mean professionally, or maybe you mean professionally as well. Perhaps you intend to peddle my services to bored Ferelden noble women. It is an interesting thought, but I've always removed my clothes strictly on an amateur basis. A talented amateur, of course, but an amateur nonetheless. Of course, all these thoughts are moot. Chances are still good that you and I will perish, eaten by darkspawn or slain by the crows at some point. Very gruesomely, I imagine. But it is pleasant <laughs> enough to chat about. Come, let's move on while our boots still have some wear in them. Okay. What is your desire? Oh, this should be good. What would you like to discuss? Whoa, this could you be a sensitive a topic, my dear lady. Are you sure you wish to voyage there? That many, huh? <laughs> As you wish. Let me start by saying that my history is varied, indeed. It has also not been restricted to women. Does that offend you? Perhaps that is entirely up to you. I grew up amongst whores, my dear. Sex is best when done well, and truly, that is my only rule. Do I prefer women? Yes, yes, I believe I do. But you must understand that a certain open-mindedness is sought by the crows in their recruits, for very good reasons. Alright, that dog needs to stop barking. I'm not alright with that? The hell kind of answer is that? I have had to do many things in my work as an assassin. Some pleasant and many not so. The crows recruit elven assassins because we are considered beautiful by humans. I'm sure you can imagine the rest. I cannot change my past, obviously. I regret far more than the men and women I have been with. And if that is more than you can bear, well, then it is good we know now, yes? <laughs> 
You're a better person than most, I suspect. Ah, enough talk of the past. It is what lies ahead that is important, no? Ooh, he likes that I like that. You look so tired, my dear. It's all this constant walking and fighting. I think uh. I know what you mean. <laughs> A horse? <laughs> my thought is this. We retire to your tent and I show you the sort of massage skills that one only learns growing up in an Antivan whorehouse. Oh. If you mean to ask whether or not there might be more than a massage involved, allow me simply to say that you won't be disappointed with any of the techniques I've picked up over the years. <laughs> I don't know about this. I mean, see... I don't want to hurt Al's feelings. But that does sound really good. A willing victim it is. And if I might ask if the opportunity to proceed past the massage should <laughs> present itself. It won't ever. Trust me. Then why are we still talking? I love Zev. I don't know, but okay. Whoa, hello. That's quite a massage. And she's still wearing her clothes. Oh. <laughs> See, I knew this would happen eventually. I should have warned you right from the moment you refused to kill me. It was inevitable. <laughs> Too bad it wasn't more enjoyable. Oh. It's true. They used to issue warnings about me at the Antivan border. Ah, the good old days. So then, as the priestess so famously said to the handsome actor, what now? <laughs> Why should anything change? Allow me to make it simple for you, my Grey Warden. What comes next is entirely up to you. I was raised to take my pleasures where they could be found, for they do not come very often. I shall ask nothing more of you than you are willing to give. Sorry, dude. You're just a side piece. I must admit, we have come very far from those early days when I tried to <laughs> kill you and you decided not to kill me. Fate is such a tricky whore. Isn't she? Uh, at any rate, we <laughs> should be on our way. A new day awaits us. Or so the rumor goes. Alright. Hey! <laughs> 17 approval. So, All right. let me ask you something. Uh oh. Personal Does question. he have a, have a problem? I'm, I'm wondering okay. about... Well, about Zevran, really. It seems like the two of you have become quite friendly. I, I'm just curious, maybe it's inappropriate of me to ask, but what are your intentions towards him? Is it very serious? Oh, Alice jealous. Ah, I, I was under the impression that the two of you were romantically involved. I, I would have said something sooner, but I... I didn't know how to put it without I mean, we sounding, are, but... You know, jealous. So, now that I've got that off my chest, let me ask something else. Ooh. Do you have any feelings towards me? I'd hoped that was the case. That... That wasn't too soon, was it? Well, I'll have to arrange that then, won't I? What about Zevran? I don't like the idea of leading him on. All right. Thank you. 
I am a lucky one. man. Oh, I should have chose that, that one. Wow. <laughs> so you're not Let's leading him on. Let's get back to <laughs> what we were up to before, lest I forget why we're here. All right. Oh, Zevran disapproves, but only 15, so I still got plus two, so Your that's okay. Your desire is my command. Only if I maxed him out and then it took 15, that'll suck, but... Of course. Oh, you still don't want to You're talk about anything else. Well, All right, well, now that I banged Zevran, let's go bang you. Your wish is my command. There we go. Okie doke. Uh, let's go talk to Moore again. I want to forget about her. I await your command. So, full of questions, are you? Uh, she doesn't have anything to camp, say. So, tis as good a time as any. <laughs> Why are you still here? <laughs> All right, I picked that one by accident once. I had to reload because it did not end well. <laughs> All right. Uh, hello, Butt. Oh, I didn't want to leave Butt alone. I wanted to pet Butt. <laughs> I am 12. <laughs> oh, but it changes the option order. I picked the second one because it was pet Butt last time. All right. There we go, pet Butt. I like how I just stand there and I don't actually pet Butt. All right. Okay, so I wanted to bring uh no, hold on. Hold on. I wanted to I think I messed this up cuz I think I only have Oh no, I don't. Okay. I wanted to bring someone with the survival skills. Al and Stan. All right. <sighs> yes. Yes. Uh, Indeed. All right. Well, I'm probably just going to come right back anyway. Okay. Yep, yep. All right, let's back to camp. All right, let's see if two survival. Oh, yeah. hold on. Oh, only compared to some. <laughs> Sten. Wow. No, I have to level up Sten. Mm. I'm going to put all that into Constitution because he is a very weak man. <laughs> all right, two handed. Two-handed sweep. Knocking them down. Damages the armor. That's pretty cool. Alright, let's do that. Alright, and then we have Morrigan. Okay. Oh, she has no skill level ups either. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my goodness, okay. Okay, she can be a flying swarm now, why not? I could be a flying swarm while you run. Okay. Let's go. Holla! Hey, I'm finally learning my way around here. Except for the invisible walls. 
Meh. How to check on my holla and I then have I don't know. Uh let's try. No. No, I'm sorry. Right. I know. No. It was kind of you to try. I will <laughs> I kill her quickly. Oh, that kills me. Meh. Meh. That holla sounds like a um goat. Oh, a goat. Alright, um... Sten's kind of useless, so I'm gonna get rid of him. Uh, I just... Mm. What other quests do we have there? Oh, we've got the companion quest. That's in Denarim. That's me getting my ass handed to me in the swamp. This doesn't say where the sword is. Marjolaine is in Denarim. Okay. Alright, let's go get Win. And then Yes. Do that quest and then we'll get yes. the heck out of here. Indeed. Alright. Bumpity bumpity bum. You know what? We should probably go there. So I don't have to run through camp. Okay. Here we go. <coughs> Why are we saving? Is there like... Oh, there's... There's bears. Okay, I'm gonna save too. Just in case. Hokey dokey. Great bear. That's not a crappy bear. It's a great bear. Yeah. Holy shit, that's a lot of dudes. Whoa. Whoa. Um, Jesus, that's that's a shit ton of bears. Alright. Alright, dudes. Yeah, enough. Set all bears on fire. was a lot easier than I was expecting. Alright. However, the spell effect is... Ugh. Messes with my mind. Alright. Um. Oh, there we go. Okay. Got any shinies? Shiny shinies? No shinies. Screw you, bears. Tombstone. Oh, I could do the tombstone things. Why are we saving again? Is there another big fight? Circles with Kate. There's a bunch of dead bodies here. I can't actually get down there from here. Ugh. Actually, the tombstones are up here. Okay. Gravestone. Oh, should we disturb it? Let's disturb it. Huh. Alright. Not 
nothing happened. Ooh! Lovely. Oh, uh. Revenant. Scarecrow, steal your mana. That's not your mana. It's my mana. All right, seriously, Al. Ooh, wind gets to uh, level up. All right, wind. Okay, let's do Arcane Mastery, of course. Okie dokie, anything shiny? No shinies. No shinies for K. Oh, there we go. Juggernaut Helm. Is it Juggernaut Helm? Oh. Oh, it's not any. Oh, that's part of that quest! I see. Okay. I can't get over there to get that. Mushroom or whatever it is. Mushroom! Now, why would you put this in a game and not make it a bridge? Why Why would you do that? What the actual hell, Bioware? You! Oh. You were the Grey Warden who broke the curse! I demand to know what yep. happened to the werewolves. Where did they go? That makes no difference. Those, those monsters killed my husband. They killed so many of my people. They have Dalish blood on their hands. If they are human once more, that shall make it all the easier to take vengeance for their crimes. Tell me mm, where they yeah, are. Yeah, I don't think so. It destroyed him. Yes. Yeah, see? Perhaps you speak wisely. If they are gone and never return here, then... Perhaps it is better to let it simply end there. We will go back to yep. the camp then. Thank you for your words. Please accept this small token of my gratitude. It belonged to my husband, and I cannot carry it any longer. Oh, okay. Okay then. Bye bye now. Corpse. Magister Cinch. Wait, that's not the same Revenant corpse that we just killed, but... No, it can't be. Was there another one over there that I didn't see? I don't know. Oh, what the hell's going on right now? Okay. Uh, I think the other gravestones... Tombstone... Why does it say tombstone on here and then it says gravestone on the the thing when you find it? That's weird. Get it together, Bioware. Alright. Let's go over here to the southeast forest. Ooh. Ooh. Boom, 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 boom. Ancient tombstone. That's the Mad Hermit. Is the Mad Hermit? No, the Mad Hermit's not that guy. I killed him anyway, so... I hope it wasn't that guy. <laughs> that would be a bummer. Hey, uh... Turns out that guy that you were trying to find, when Yeah, I kind of a little bit killed him. Just a little bit. A little, little, little kill. He's a little bit dead. Where is the tomb stone? It's a bad idea to rub off the runes on a gravestone. Let's disturb the war. Oh, the legend of the juggernaut. Oh, dear. What the fuck is going on over here? Uh oh. <laughs> 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 
The cat is currently suckling on my hand while I play. And that is very strange. The shit is this? You are not welcome here. Oh. Doing the Templars dirty work for them, eh? Templars or mages, it means nothing to us. There is dark power here. And, you and we're gonna wave our arms at it. Our way. Okay, well, I mean... I guess... I am gonna just fireball you to death. Steal your mana. What's this? It's fire. Alright. Got shinies. <laughs> Alistair. My bruises are all bruised now. Black hand gauntlets. Oh. Alright. Any other shinies? Oh, the revenant over here. Juggernaut plate boots. Alright, now. Oh, they are. They are showing up in here. Alright, let's see. Juggernaut. That's not very good. Oh, it's a helm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, um, all right. The juggernaut. Hmm. Hey, look who I found. Just get along. Oh, goodness. Why are there so many bandits over here? Give me that mana. That's not your mana. I think we work well together. Yeah, I think so too, Al. Thanks. Alright, can we do the thing that I actually wanted to do? Let's talk to this guy. Friends, turn back, please. These woods are a danger to those who do not know the paths. A Niren? Wait, I... I remember your face. But younger, more impulsive, stern. Win? I thought they had killed you. They very nearly did. The Templars found me while I was searching for the Dalish. They ran me through and left me for dead. I brought this on you. Oh, I was a dreadful mentor, harsh and impatient. I, I am sorry for the way I treated you. I've put that behind me, and you should too. I didn't fit in with the Templars in your family. <laughs> My path lay elsewhere. Okay. Odin is a reasonable man. He will find some way for you to return. The Circle needs new blood. It needs to change. I have fond memories of Irving. He was always kind to me. I will consider your proposal, and perhaps I will speak with Irving. However, I promise nothing. Perhaps the mage you seek is right in front of you. The Grey Warden is a mage, no? The Blight will not last forever. Why not look to her to shape the new circle? It is something Ooh. both of you should think about. Likewise. My years in the circle were not a complete waste. I learned more than I let on. You did teach me, Wynne. <laughs> Even if you you didn't did teach know me when, even if you're a total bitch. It's the hardened sap of a tree native to this forest. It's been something of a lucky charm for me, and now I want you to have it. Very well. I'm grateful. May your gods smile on you and Erin. And on you. Aw, what a delightful reunion. Welcome back. Is there something I can do for you? Of course. <laughs> Oh, he's Welcome a healer. Back. Is I there forgot. something I can do for you? I did. Oh, why didn't he stay? 
The tribe made me feel very welcome, as though I were a lost child. They taught me elven magics and told me the old stories, but I wasn't one of the Dalish, no more than I was a circle mage. I owe them much, and so I stay close by, but I do not count myself among their number. My home is out here in the forest with the trees and animals. I learned to listen to them, and they taught me well. Yes, she mentioned it. It is quite a miracle, isn't it? When did she mention it? We just met you. <laughs> I cannot explain it. Perhaps the spirit felt she had a task to perform. One last apprentice to teach. She is spending Ooh, her last me? days in your company, helping you in your quest. Perhaps this is what she feels she needs to do. I don't bear grudges. And it was Wynne who showed me that the circle wasn't really where I was supposed to be. She is a good person with a noble heart. She always tries to do what she thinks is best for others. She tried so hard with me, I could tell. Unfortunately, I wasn't listening. And all she knew to do back then was yell more. I forgave her many years ago. It's a shame she carried that guilt for so long. Go in peace then. I friend. should go. Alright. So let's get all the shinies from these guys. Landmark tent. What, what is with these landmarks? Tree stump. Oh, okay. Fine. Right, this cat desperately wants to be on me right now as I play. Why do you want to be on me? Hmm? Why, why do you always need to be touching me, kitty? Oh, they're in the Mad Hermit clearing. I see. That's why there was a tree stump. Okay. Alright, let's uh let's get to that tomb. Oh, wrong way. Tomb Tomba Stone. AKA gravestone. I have a feeling this is not gonna be great. I have a feeling I should definitely save. Cat, that that is a claw directly in my flesh. Can you please not? All right, let's disturb him. Revenant. I want to know why. Liliana is, is ranged, but she walks right up to the bad guy. Look at her, she's like, her bow is a foot away from the dude. Waiting for my shinies. Maybe I can have shinies. There we go. Quest completed. Juggernaut. All the items hidden by the Tevinter Mage. Alright. I just have the Hala. Killing people was one of the creatures you summoned. Oh, okay. Return to the ch Oh, the tr <laughs> the things I summoned in the mage's tower. Whoops! Alright, I should report to the chantry. Do I have to report back in Redcliffe or can I just go to Denerum? Because the Denerum is... Denerum one is much, much closer. run through the entire town. Oh. That's the wrong way. <laughs> um, I have to run through the entire town of Redcliffe to get to the Chantry there. Dead bodies and bones and all kinds of stuff. 
How the heck do we get out of here? I think it's this way. Okie dokie. What is over here? Nothing. We just gotta go that way. Juggernaut. Yep. Go back to camp to treat injuries, huh? I was not aware that that was a thing. Oh, what is this? <gasps> oh, Jesus. This fucking game, man. Alright. Have a little fire, Scarecrow! Ah, that's right. It's super effective. Oh, that's the Grand Oak again. I wonder if that... to thee once again. Oh. Thou hast not yet left the forest, then? Oh, I forgot about Rami McRimerson. Landmark tree. Nothing. Oh, what do these landmark things do? Oh, uh. gross. Oh, I can't actually get out that way. North. This way. Except I can't. Uh, it's an invisible wall. I hate invisible walls. Alright. See, the problem is once I actually need to find the landmark thing, I'm not going to remember where they are. <laughs> Alright, let's get the heck out of here. Feels like there should be an easier way to fast travel from here, but it doesn't let me travel anywhere. I have to get to the world map, but that's dumb because then I have to go all the way back. You just really want to be a part of this, huh, Kat? Alright. Dealer's camp. I can't believe it's you. Cure the holla, because nobody has any useful skills. You remind me of Lady Cecily. Who? She was an Orlesian lady. My mother served her until she died, and Lady Cecily let me stay instead of turning me out on the street. You are like her in some ways. You have the same poise, the same air of nobility. Oh, child, <laughs> I am hardly noble. I learned that nobility isn't just something you are born with. I have met nobles who are very petty and mean, complete degenerates. Then, there are people with a certain dignity and grace. It draws you to them, no matter who you are or who they are. I think the lowest peasant can have the most noble spirit and it will always shine through. It is this nobility of spirit that you share with Cecily. Why, thank you, Liliana. It is very kind of you to say Aww. that. Aww. 
Okay. Um. <sighs> Suppose I could go to Denerim. Start doing those quests there. Alright, let's see what Wynne has to say now. Thank you so much. Yes, you led me to an errand. You persisted, even though I was sure all you were going to find was a dead end. I will never be able to repay you for what you've done for me. Finding an errand allowed me to bring that chapter of my life to a close. I feel free. A great weight has been lifted off my heart. This moment, oh, good. it feels like the moment before the sunrise, when all the world is still, holding its breath, waiting for first light. I can stop thinking about my past and look forward to the future. Thank you, my friend. You will always have my gratitude. You're welcome. Alright. Now... What is this over here? Another... Little carty cart. Enchantment? Enchantment! Historian's <laughs> might. I don't have anything to put in there. Did I get rid of all the runes? I didn't. Oh, you know what? They're back at the the um, Soldier's Peak. That's where they are. Oh, do I actually want to go all the way back there? <sighs> Juggernaut plate glove. Sten? Oh, Sten? That would be a pretty good upgrade for him, Alistair. Oh, that would be a good... Oh, that would be a really good upgrade. Okay. So I think... We're gonna give... Al... All the juggernaut shit. And then... Oh, there's no juggernaut. Oh. Juggernaut ar armor, gloves, and boots. Okay, so there is juggernaut armor. Did I get that? Okay, maybe. Enchantment! Maybe I got that last time, and it's at the. Um, Soldier's Peak. Okay, let's yes. try that. Indeed. Indeed. Okay, let's go to Soldier's Peak. Let's raft down the river. Go ahead. I'd say we were going the long way around. Um, jug, jug, jug or not. A, okay. So we have Al here, so let's complete his set. There we go. Oof. Then we can give the other stuff to. Maybe I'll just take everything out of here. Give all the other stuff to Sten, and then maybe he won't suck. Alright. That is why you suck. 
you get to be a warden commander now? How do you like them apples? that better I understand okay oh plus two attack all right let's see what else we got oh Templar helm is better okay Liliana's got um, nope. Nope. Uh, she can't wear that. Okay, gauntlets, gauntlets, gauntlets. Studded leather gloves. Oh, that's better. Slightly. Ancient element. Oh, she's... Well... Let's give her the, uh, oh, she can't have the ancient element. Oh my god. Alright, instead of leather gloves it is. are better. Alright. I'll give her studded leather. Okay. And then armor. Oh. Dealish Suited leather armor. Oh, okay. Oh. You know what? We're gonna give her the studded leather helm because then she gets a bonus, right? Oh, wait. Studded leather armor. Oh, no. She, she can get, have whatever, uh, whatever hat she wants. Alright. Okay. L is good. Good Morgan. Alright, let's see. Helm, 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 helm. Robes of Avernus. Oh, those are ugly. Nope, 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 nope. I put Morgan back in her regular clothes. There we go. Uh, right, let's see. I don't have any cowls. Hmm. All right. Let's see what kind of. Stuff she can wear. Cunning and health generation is going to be pretty hard to beat. Gauntlets. She's got ash and gloves. Oh, that's the cold damage. Yeah, we want to want to keep the cold damage. Oh, that's only ten percent. Okay. 
Let's do the leather boots. She cannot wear fade striders. Um, I might give her this, the fade striders actually. She can't wear any of the other stuff. Yeah, let's give her the fade striders. That works. Okay. But. Me. Oops. Uh, bum, 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 bum. I do like the fire damage because I use this fire spells quite a bit. hard to top with things that I can actually wear. Alright. Alright. That's good. Alright, then we have Zev. Let's go back to the beginning. Don't you love inventory management? Okay. Let's see. Helmet. Yeah, that one. Okay. Studded leather or hard leather? Hardened leather. Reinforced leather. This one's better armor, but that one has physical resistance. Oh, well, we're going to do that one. Okay. Okay. Gauntlets. That's a mage. gloves. Everybody has got dexterity. Oh. It's armor. Mm. I can't wear that anyway. Alright. I think I'm just gonna leave on the dexterity. That seems like a good bonus. Alright. He'd probably get mad. Oh, you know what? I wonder if he gets, uh, it's a bonus if you have all in even leather stuff. <laughs> Alright. Ooh. However. That's way better. It's got dexterity. However. That other that leather armor was really good. This guy. Hmm. Oh, plus two armor. Why don't they just put it eight point something instead of... Alright. Oh, he can't wear it! Farts. Armor of diligence. Give up a point of armor for a point of dexterity. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Alright. Did, did we do win? I don't know that we did win. <laughs> Alright. Black hand gauntlets. Those are, those are better. She has now. You know, she's not. Oh. Sure, let's do that. Okay. Alright. Okay. And boots is. Well, she can't wear the ones that are better. So. Because she keeps those boots. Where? <sighs> I 
Ops of Avernus. She's never gonna do blood magic, so. Sten, we already got. Liliana, we already got. Alistair, we got Morgan, we got Butt, we got. And me. Alright. So now I need to go through and decide what to get rid of. Okay. We're going to get rid of anything that's less than What's tier that's tier 4. Anything less than tier 4. What was that? Oh. I feel weird getting rid of that. That is armor. Let's go sell off our junk. <laughs> Are you sure I can't interest you in this hat? A pair of it? I'm sure you'll be. <sighs> what hat? You don't even have any hats. Oh wait, maybe you do. Resistance. Yep. It's the same one I had. Eh. Eh. Bard's dancing shoes. Oh, I could get Liliana some shoes. She would love that. Let us sell our junk. Alright. Alright, I think that's actually it for tonight. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.